Right, hello. So, going to be looking at Radar Opus again, and this time we're going to be um, focusing on the search function. So up here, you've got your search button. If you click there, you can start entering a keyword to search for. Press enter after you finish typing the word, then enter again to launch the search. And one of the cool things you can do is to control click on the word, well that's right click on a Windows, and it opens up this view. So you can see there's roots and branches, so different types of the word anger, and synonyms here. Okay, so you could add those individually, or just select all, and hit OK. Now we need to launch the search again, so I click here. Okay, helmets from anger, but also if we scroll down, we should start to see some synonyms of anger, hatred, rage, okay, violent. Now you could uh, change the search again with a, uh, by adding another word, let's put in alternating and see what we get now. So let's use this rubric here and I can just pick that up and drag it and drop it into the clipboard. So if I want to look at the clipboard I can press here or I can press on the analysis. Okay. But for now let's continue searching. I'm going to press F4 this time which is the shortcut to take me to that same window and start typing another word and this time I'm going to click on the rubric and so this takes us to I'm just going to hide that table of contents with command F2 this takes us to the repertory itself where we can view the full rubric with all the remedies and you can see here that there are cross references as well um, so what we could do is, if we hold down command, we could select another rubric there, or that one, let's take that one away, and what we can do now is hold the shift and the equals key, and it knows that I've selected two rubrics, so it's given them here the number one, that's uh, like a weighting for the intensity of the symptom and A which is to say that it belongs to a group the two rubrics together so let's take those and if you hit F8 it will take you straight to your analysis window and so now both of those rubrics are together in the group defined by the letter A right now let's hit F4 again to do another search and start typing another keyword and what we could do here is take that rubric and this one to make one all together and I can do the same thing here shift equals and this time type one for the intensity and B because it's the next group and we've taken those and they are grouped as well okay let's do another search F4 let's type 12 and return return again 12 this time I'm just going to grab that rubric and drop it in and let's do another one held so maybe these two here have a similar meaning so I'll do the same thing select them both with a tick box shift equals key one for the intensity C for the group 
and they go into whichever clipboard is selected with the tick. You can change that by holding Alt and clicking on a different clipboard. And let us also add one more. Again, I just press F4 and this charge. Lovely. And search for that. <coughs> Let's say I wanted to specify the chapter generals. I'm going to just go down to the one in capitals because that is the one for synthesis. Hit return again. And let's take this rubric here. Okay, so if I hit F8 <coughs> and then Command F2, there's the view for my analysis. Okay, so if we just select a remedy and control click, I can search for this remedy in all open repertories. <coughs> so we're looking at the remedy now in synthesis, the 7,000 odd results. So if we come up here and control click on the remedy name, we could deselect these and just look at bold type. Remedies. Remember that you need to relaunch the search. And uh, we're down to 219 results of just the, re just the rubrics where the remedy is in bold type. And another thing we can do is put those back in. Rubrics containing less than or equal to run one remedy. And now this will show us single symptom remedies. Launch that search again. And there they all are. So this might give you some clues into uh, SRP <coughs> symptoms of that particular remedy. If I hit F8 again and Command F2 to get rid of that table. And now if I just uh, click on the remedy, <coughs> I can go to the keynotes. This will give us the uh, families, and we could check on the miasm, or indeed Sankaran miasm. And this time, if I go to the search window here, and the advanced search, we could be looking for um, the ringworm miasm. Hit return and just hit that little blue arrow there. So let's select rubrics containing more than or equal to 10 remedies. Okay, hit return. So now it's searching the repertory for any ringworm remedy. So all these rubrics here that were being displayed have at least 10 ringworm remedies in them. So it's an interesting way to study that miasm through the repertory. Equally, we could go back to the keynotes. Here they are. We're in the families tab. And go to the family. So we're looking at the Solanaceae. Come back to the search. Hit uh, F5, takes you to a new search window. Or you can find it from here. And this time in the families, we can start typing so, and it predicts what we want. We hit return, hit return again, and just do the same thing here. Rubrics more than or equal to 10 remedies. Hit return, hit return to launch the search. Great.